<clears throat> hey collective welcome to collectively chosen it's miss kelly coming to you with your sneak peek at the week <clears throat> thank you so much for your love and support it's greatly appreciated thank you for your donations your bookings they're all well received and i hope that you have love peace prosperity and positivity in your life and your journey so overall energy is the nine of cups beautiful starting out for the week feeling fulfilled about where you're going the direction of your future okay i do feel like you could be coming into a very happy time after some sort of heartache or heartbreak here okay beautiful energy though so getting clear on well, some sort of heartache heartbreak coming into that energy of just feeling fulfilled and where you are right now in your journey okay oh boy ten of swords so could be some sort of betrayal here okay this week high priestess we have the page of <coughs> sorry knight of pentacles and then we have the two of scepters Let's see. And we have the Wheel of Fortune. All right, if you're getting something, uh, ooh, something that's been taking its time coming in for you or coming towards you, I feel like you're getting ready to be blessed with it, okay? Um, your family is protected at this time with the Temperance and the Ten of Cups, okay? Um... I'm also seeing here that, again, if you're about to be blessed with some sort of abundance or some sort of change in luck, keep all of your business to you, okay, is what I'm getting with that. Keep your business your business. All right, let's see what else is going on for my collective this week. New beginnings. All right, new beginnings. You're choosing to move forward from betrayals that could have happened in the past here. All right. Yeah. Ooh, strong King of Cups. You have a King of Cups here. Okay. That could be watching you here. This could be a past lover. Mm. Of some whatever they something that they planned is not working out. Okay. They did, yeah. This person could reach out to you. Wow. Look how this just popped out. All right, the night of, mm, mm hmm This person is coming to be deceptive, all right, but you're going to see the truth in the situation. You see the truth about this person. This person could be reaching out to you to give you some sort of truth. Mm -hmm. Okay, yeah. All right, we have a king of pentacles here. That could possibly come and show up at your home. All right. Somebody here wants to celebrate with you, I feel like, as well. Four cups. I mean, what was it? Four cups. Interesting. So maybe that's someone that you rejected at some point before. Somebody could have been hiding or somebody could be hiding that they're living with someone or that they're married. This person may want to come and give you some truth about that. Yeah, three of cups in the reverse, okay? So somebody here definitely, um, if somebody's coming to you to give you some sort of heartfelt message, I do feel like this person here, they are still entertaining a third party or this would be a third party situation. You can have a queen of pentacles as well that lives near you, okay? This could, okay, confirmation ace of swords uh you can have a queen of pentacles that live near you this person could be either a fake friend okay this person could be thinking that they're hiding something but no you already know this person is waiting what is what is the seven of pentacles thank you death card they're waiting for some sort of an ending here, but there's some sort of change coming in for you. I feel like you're getting ready to um, get some new collab, like there's a new collaboration or new job 
that's coming open for you here, okay? All right, we have here... Mm, there could be something going on here with a page of cups. Could be dealing with a Scorpio here with the death being here as well. All right, and then we have here with the six of wands. There could be a cycle closing here for a page of cups, okay? Some sort of cycle of, uh, you know, juggling finances, all right? You could end up finding out, oh. the ace of cups here somebody here could be pouring themselves like pouring more love into themselves okay there's some sort of ten of pentacles here that's coming in for someone here there's love and some sort of finances coming in for somebody here something that you manifested here okay we got the five of cups with the five of swords or well, somebody is trying to manifest this to, to you? What the hell? Let's see. Why is the magician here? Why is the magician here? Okay. Eight of Wands. Somebody is trying to manifest some sort of... Trying to stop someone's movement. Okay. Trying to stop someone's movement. Somebody is not communicating something here possibly this week. Some sort of conflict here. Nine of Pentacles Cross. Why is the five of wands here? Temperance. Yeah, okay. So I feel like somebody here could be getting ready to walk away from some sort of family situation here. What is the Empress reverse? Page of Pentacles. Somebody is going to want to apologize for some sort of betrayal. Yeah, somebody is in their head. Why is the Empress reversed? Eight of Swords. Somebody's really in their head about something here. Hangman cross, five of pentacles. So somebody here could be watching or <sighs> Oh gosh, I get so sick of this energy. <clears throat> a lot of people involved in something here of somebody possibly trying to see somebody be in some sort of poverty be codependence okay what is the five of pentacles and the devil four of swords five of pentacles the devil thank you justice the sun ace of wands in the reverse I feel like something here that somebody has been doing is not working um somebody could be stuck trying to figure out either why you're not in some sort of lack I don't know. I just feel this energy of like somebody trying to. Some of y'all, you could have turned someone down sexually. I'm getting that. 
You could have turned someone down sexually, and this is a burden for them. Ace of Wands reverse. Something is something that is not going the way that somebody anticipated. You're being protected. Somebody who wanted you in some sort of lack, I feel like it's getting this lack. Yeah, nine of cups cross. Nine of Wands reverse. Okay, so somebody knows that they have to give up something here. Um, or they're getting ready to give up. They could be wanting to make you some sort of offer or they made some sort of offer in the past. All right, I'm getting to, like I said, this is some sort of sexual thing. All right, this person feels like, yeah, uh, this person could feel like you walked away from the situation. There could have been some sort of argument. All right, this person is feeling like you betrayed them. So somebody here, I'm getting that somebody that didn't see your worth at one point in time. Yeah, they tried to play you like you was rich. Yeah. Tried to play you like you was some sort of, this is what I'm some sort of hoe or something. Yeah. You have a, a queen of wands in the reverse that's watching you. And then we got the king of wands. What is this page of swords? The tower. Somebody's having some sort of tower moment here. Okay. I don't know why I just heard whistle while you work. <laughs> All right. Tower. All right. This could be somebody that's getting ready to have some sort of tower in the future here. All right. You could have been guided to move away. Block this out. All right. But look. Yeah, this King of Cups here, there, could, there, there might be some sort of argument or something brewing here. Why is the Knight of Swords cross? I'm feeling passive-aggressive energy here, all right? Somebody here could be going through some sort of uh, depression here or they felt rejected here. All right, something is changing. Something is changing, something that somebody don't see. So something you don't see this week is possibly getting ready to change. All right. Uh, some, mm, somebody could have lost their work. What is the Eight of Pentacles reverse? Yeah, something somebody didn't see coming. Could be a boss that made some sort of a judgment. So somebody, this King of Cups is trying to make some sort of decision on which way to go. This could be you or this could be someone else. You take it how it resonates for you. <clears throat> um, give me a Six of Swords. Move away from some sort of confusion. Page of Pentacles, the Moon, and the Chariot. Give me the Full Cross. High priestess reverse. Mm, some sort of some sort of secret or something. Either see okay. So something about somebody collaborating. Yeah, it's some sort of secret that's coming out here. Uh possibly by the King of Pentacles, Taurus energy. Come, we have strong Pisces, we have Cancer here. All right, we have Aquarius, Aries, Sagittarius. Okay, with the sun, yeah, something is being exposed here. Something from the past, uh, some sort of five of swords. What's the sun? The world reverse. Something is not closed. Something is not closed here. Why is the world in the reverse? Knight of Wands. Three of Swords. There could be a uh, fire sign here that's in some sort of regret that they did not 
uh, take the opportunity to have a relationship with you. Okay, or they didn't give and receive with you in the past is what I'm getting here. This person could be trying to hold on to you, but this person could have also held back some sort of resources. Okay. Three of Swords. The Star. This person is hoping to heal something. Yeah, they're hoping to come back and apologize. Some of you could be dealing with an Aquarius here that you walked away from. All right, you could have walked away from this Knight of uh, Wands as well. Hmm. Yeah, these are people that you had to set some sort of boundary with regardless of the fact that you had some sort of emotions for them in the first place. Like I said, somebody is regretting either not taking an opportunity to get in a commitment or a relationship with you. You could have turned your back on this situation and went and moved on to your higher self. There's definitely a, a Taurus here. Okay. Hmm. That somebody could have came in between you and somebody coming together is what I'm saying as well. All right, let's see. Clarify the rest. <laughs> that was a lot that came out. Yeah, somebody thought you either were naive or... All right, somebody did something foolish. Yeah, we have the death and the devil. I don't like that energy. Somebody here could have been trying to do death magic here. Okay, but it did not work. The Eight of Pentacles in the reverse. Something went back, okay? Something went back. What is the High Priest? Will of Fortune, sorry. Let's see. Mm, okay. Six of Wands. Some sort of attention recognition here coming. Uh, I don't like how they came out. All right. Uh, six of Wands, Four of Cups. Six of Wands, Four of Cups. Hmm. Some of you, this could also be like a... A psychic as well that's doing something here yeah somebody that you could have moved away from somebody here that's juggling somebody wants to make some sort of amends wanting to come out of the cold here ace of pentacles there's a new there's something coming in that I feel like is going to make someone very happy. All right, but you're going to have to make some sort of a choice, make a decision what direction you want to go. Yeah. All right, something here could be dealing with something online here. There's a king of wands that want to make some sort of offer. What is the ten of cups and the temperance? All right, we have the Six of Cups and the Page of Wands reverse. So there's somebody here, again, that you're not speaking to or talking to. Somebody wants some sort of family dynamic with you. Why is the Page of Wands in the reverse? Some sort of bad news. All right, Three of Swords reverse. Why is the Page of Wands here in the reverse? Queen of Pentacles. Somebody could be reaching out to you, texting. All right. Some of you, this could be a family member. All right. You may not be responding to text messages. Okay. I'm getting that here. Yeah. Six of Pentacles in the reverse. Somebody that there was no equal give and take here. Whether it's a family or not. Yeah. Bad investment. You felt as though you didn't want to invest in whoever this is, or you don't want to invest in whoever this is. Confirmation. Seven of Pentacles reverse. Yeah, you're done playing games with people. All right, some of you, you could feel like that, you know, people don't want you to see that they're only coming around you for some sort of gain here. But 
somebody here is feeling defeated because whatever they thought they were going to invest in or they were going to take action towards when it came to you that it did not pan out was not panning out five stores at first yeah power fence sticking to your guns okay um hmm, yeah so i'm getting this energy of past people you're just not entertaining you're not indulging you don't want no parts no parts of anybody who backstabbed and betrayed you you're more so you're looking towards your future here is what i'm getting so yeah you 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 know you you still care about people you know but you're choosing not to invite certain people back into your life Okay. Yeah, there's definitely somebody. Okay, there's a King of Pentacles that's definitely in their head. They could be thinking that you're in another relationship. That's why you're not communicating with them. That's not why you're not speaking to them. Okay, uh, what about this King of Pentacles? So I feel like they're thinking about making you some sort of offer here. But they could be afraid that you are not in the best energy of receiving this offer. Alright, so they are in some sort of regret here. All right, for possibly coming off kind of sneaky. I feel like this person want to have a conversation with you. They do. Seven, uh, they want to tell you some sort of truth here. Yeah, that, I, I feel like that they're sorry. I feel like this person's trying to muster up the strength to apologize to you. They may feel like something just may not work, though. I feel like they want to apologize for not putting in any effort. And they know that's why you walked away. Okay? So, that's what I'm saying for you. Uh, this week, somebody really feels like that they understand why you walked away. Okay, uh, why? Yeah, they realize that they didn't put in any effort. And they know why you cut communication with them. Okay, so if this person at one point in time was acting oblivious, they're not oblivious to what is going on here. All right, uh, you're being, you're highly protected though. That's what I'm seeing here. You know, you may have to experience people having sharp words, having something to say. Uh, there could be some sort of argument that a boss figure may try to get into with you. But, yeah. The fool in the reverse, nine of wands in the reverse. Yeah, somebody hit me. Mm. Temperance and the Queen of Pentacles. King of Swords. The Empress. Didn't I say somebody I feel like they don't want somebody to see your worth here? Or they didn't want somebody to see your worth? Give me the Emperor. This is a marriage here. Yeah, there's a job or something getting ready to be extended here to somebody. If you've been in a hermit, I feel like something is getting ready to um, open up. I feel like definitely, like I say, keep your business, your business. Okay, with the moon here, there is some sort of deception or something that's getting ready to come out here. Look. 
be very mindful of a boss or somebody trying to start some sort of drama this could be because you um you may get another position so somebody here may get another position or get a thank you confirmation ace of swords some of you may get another job offer or get a job offer and you're going to have a boss or a supervisor that's going to be pissed off about it and this person may actually say something a bit reckless out of their mouth okay I'm just saying <laughs> that's what I'm seeing so you're gonna see how this per this person what they say to you is gonna prove to you exactly how they truly feel so they were trying to hold this to themselves I feel like they ain't gonna be able to hold it too much longer yeah three of pentacles what I say they ain't gonna be able to hold it too much longer but I feel like that's gonna bring something to completion something to an end yeah i just feel like whatever you have to say just don't play any games about it you know if you need to let this person know that the position the job has been much of a burden you don't feel as though it was a good investment all right you don't feel as though you you being there is a good investment and that's why you're choosing to walk away okay then hey that's what it is but i feel like there's an empress standing up to an emperor here okay Somebody being logical. There could also be some sort of argument between... So, I don't know. There's a third-party situation going on. There could be an argument between an empress and a... Uh, an empress and a queen of pentacles. Some of you, you have a decision to make about a relationship here, relationship or a friendship. Knight of Swords, yeah. There could be some sort of argument here between somebody here that's making somebody. So if there's a connection that's coming in for y'all, there could be somebody in the background that is in some sort of regret here. Yeah trying to sneak their way back towards you i feel like they're trying to find a way to sneak their way back towards you all right let's see let's get y'all some prophecies so i'm getting this energy too Somebody going to see you like in this nine of cups energy and they're going to be trying to do their damnness to kind of like get you out of that. So you're responsible for your own happiness collective. Nobody can dictate your happiness but you. You are moving or relocating in the near future. Within the next few months, you will find that you are being pushed out of your comfort zone by external forces. Sorry, y'all. By external forces in order to induce and promote growth. You are being guided to expand your horizons at this time and leave your comfort zones behind and to be open to new opportunities that will soon come your way. All right, we have someone will reach out to you in the near future with an offer that will that will improve your finances. You will soon rise above a conflict that has challenged you in the past, which will allow you to move forward towards happier times. A change of career job will come to pass. This will benefit your overall future and long term goals. That's why I say there will be a boss that's going to be highly upset. Okay.
challenges that have held that once held you back will soon be cleared out what once felt like it was impossible and unconquerable will now feel minuscule and then we have be mindful of your surroundings and the company you keep as you will be feeling sensitive to the energies of others at this time which in turn could affect your vibration someone who you wouldn't expect will make it known that they have feelings for you The loss of a loved one will be inevitable, but spirit will send you supportive energies at this time. Okay, so my condolences to anyone who may lose someone. We have one more, please. Oh, wow. <laughs> out of all these cards, this came out again. <laughs> Someone who you wouldn't expect will make it known that they have feelings for you. So definitely anticipate that this week, that somebody is going to make it real clear that they have feelings for you. Within this year, you will be highly recognized within your career and business endeavors. Abundance will surely follow. All right. a couple for money well, just definitely whoever that boss is don't go back and forth with the mind games speak very clear make your communication very clear but don't don't give in to their games All right, Buddha, life purpose, more than money, spiritual wealth. All right, counselor, being guided, divine path. Clover, lucky break, gamble, good fortune, chance, finance, outdoors, risky business surprises. And then we have candle, ambition, taking action, hustle, manifest money, management, high rank, visibility, athletic. And at the bottom here. We have extra money, mature investment, celebration, retail beauty, finished work, retirement, all right? So I do feel like this energy of there's going to be a lot of um, prosperity coming into you. But the thing of it is what Spirit wants you to know that not all prosperity has anything to do with just money, all right? This is going to be like um, just self-fulfillment, spiritual abundance, right? Um, you getting closer to spirit, which in turn, everything, of course, has no choice but to align itself. So some of you, you might want to uh, burn candles in order to help you manifest what it is you're trying to manifest. All right. But you're some of y'all are getting ready to see yourself ascend into a higher ranking. OK, beautiful energy. I like it. We have Enchanter, self-evaluation, awakening to purpose. So I feel like you are awakening to your purpose, collective. All right. I feel like there's going to be like some sort of epiphany here for you this week. Okay. We have here Spectres, discernment, critical thinking, insight. All right. So you are going to have people who have their eyes on you. People who... Um, could possibly be a bit critical this week. Remember, we say we kind of felt that energy. So just, you know, don't feed into other people's stuff, okay? Just make sure that you continue to act with integrity. You know, when people do things that are unfair, you still make sure that you're doing things that you're supposed to, you know, you do things in a fair way. Yeah, we have faith here. Hope, inspiration, rejuvenation, okay? Some of you may find yourselves um, doing a lot more praying this week, all right? 
some of you you may need to get you some rest i'm saying that that we have here beloved look love reciprocity intertwinement so there's definitely somebody that i feel like is going to <laughs> come towards you success blessings and positivity all right so stay ooh, stay in that energy hard work diligence and progress even through the adversity you know that people are going to be possibly trying to throw your way this is just you know another test of um building your strength building your character so that is all in your perspective and how you look at it yes confidence passion self-worth look prosperity right behind it wealth contentment abundance i'm trying to tell you baby reclaiming your power i love this okay um i'm hearing um i know why the cage bird sings i'm hearing that so some of you may be reading that book or you might need to all right and then we have movement quick decisions progress so this is about you just moving full steam ahead okay cutting out all the noise all the bs staying faithful in your path on your path and in your journey that's what matters most you staying faithful on your path and your journey you know people may call you approved call it what you want <laughs> okay let them call you what they want baby but at the end of the day you you're staying true to yourself and you're staying true to your journey so I, like i said to me beautiful energy i just feel like people are going to be a bit irritated by seeing you yeah opportunistic events um people are going to be a bit irritated by seeing you being in this wish fulfilled energy like you're not looking for anybody else to fulfill you you're finding contentment and fulfillment within you and your and your your journey uncover nostalgia sentimentally um sentimentality and then we have memory and at the bottom we have conjure higher self fertility creativity so some of you all are definitely working on um manifestations or you need to be able to eat at a decent time tonight yeah see make a decision don't settle for less Pray from the heart. Prayer can really move mountains. Reach out to the divine with your heart's concerns and watch miracles unfold. Prioritize self-care. You do so much for others. It's time for you to experience the love you deserve and let others help you. Take control of your thoughts. Your thoughts are creating your reality. Have faith and stay focused on the outcome that you truly desire. So don't focus on what could go wrong. Focus on everything that can go right, Jim. <laughs> Collective. Look, that don't settle for less came back out again. You are a child of the divine. You deserve to have your dreams come true. Don't give up. Stay the course. Don't panic. You're not on the wrong path. You're just having a bumpy start. Learn from your experiences and keep going. Step into the spotlight. You have a message that the world needs to hear. It's time to share your wisdom. Welcome abundance into your life. Prosperity is on its way to you. Have faith that source will heal your financial challenges. So you are having some sort of financial challenges. You're not feeling as confident. Just know that spirit is getting ready to help you change that around. But your thoughts is going to also be very important because you don't want to manifest against yourself, right? Um rain yeah regain your focus trivial life matters are distracting you from your goals archangel metatron and i are here to help you stay grounded so 
talk to your ancestors and stuff a little bit more. And just make sure that, you know, you are praying. When you do pray, you pray from the heart. Please close out. It's closer than you think. Do it, but be smart about it. Okay? When something is a lot closer than you think, the right person will find you. Don't forget, though, yeah, get rid of distractions. So, you know, don't worry about people who didn't see your worth collective. The right person, the right people will find you. You don't have to go searching for anything. See, focus on the journey more than the outcome. Allow yourself to transform. It is what it is. Trust your intuition. Don't let your ego be in charge. Stay in your lane. Bad habits are slowing you down. Loosen your grip. Things are happening behind the scenes. Control is an illusion. Focus on the journey more than the outcome. Strip away the illusion to get to the truth. And don't be fooled. Not anybody who think they are. The Spirit says it's time to get to work. Okay? time to get to work so that's what i have for you my collective i hope these messages resonated for you in some way shape or form like i say you let nobody take you out of your comfort zone all right keep yourself focused all right if you gotta you know stay to yourself stay to yourself <laughs> okay all right, that's, that's what I'm saying here. Don't let anybody come in and try to disrupt your energy. But what I say is that there's somebody who's watching you who's heartbroken that you definitely walked away from them. Okay? Um, but even though you're in this energy of being fulfilled all on your own, you're going to have people that want to come in and disturb that peace because you're off on a new beginning, off on a new journey. Yeah, look at this. It's a lot of things coming in for you okay collective all right so there are going to be a lot of options for you to choose as well you're not going to be able to hold on to all of them all right so there there's also a a, a libra here who's trying to hold on to you for their life so this is somebody who this person is sneaky <laughs> this person is very sneaky yeah, what I tell you. They're trying to sneak some sort of new beginning. They think that they can mind fuck you into some new beginning. Absolutely not. I just feel like you being happy on your own is gonna it's irritating a lot of people. That's all. But I love y'all. See you in the next one. Peace.